Welcome to this EndNote tutorial. In this video, you will learn how to save and backup your reference library in EndNote. Part 1 Save Your Reference Library. To save your reference library, simply close the program and saving is automatically done. When you save your library, a pair of items will be saved. This includes an ENL file and a data folder. When you move the items, make sure you move them together. You will not be able to open your reference library again if you lose one of these items. Part 2. Save a copy of your library. You may save a copy of your library for backup purpose by clicking on File, then Save a Copy. This is similar to how you save a copy of your Word document. Create a separate folder to host these two copied items so they won't be mixed with other EndNote files. Part 3. Synchronize with EndNote Online. You may also back up your library through synchronization with your EndNote Online account. In this way, you can access your library from any device anywhere. Make sure you have registered an EndNote account. You can register an EndNote account for free if you don't have one. EndNote will recommend you to do a local backup before the synchronization. Be aware that, you can only sync one library to your online account. Synchronizing two libraries online will mix all references from these two libraries. You can access the synchronized references online library from myannoteweb.com. To download the online references into a new library of another computer, click on the sync button and log in with your AnNote account credentials. The references will then be synchronized to your new library. If you have any questions, Please contact your faculty librarians.